Hello everyone, how are you? Your English teacher, Ayara Ja. Our lesson today is a story, which is the secret of the Egyptian cat. Do you know what's the meaning of the secret? Yes, al sir of the Egyptian cat. Egyptian is relating to Egypt. So, the Egyptian cat means Al-Qit al-Masri. So, the story today is the secret of the Egyptian cat. At the end of this story, we will know what's the secret of the Egyptian cat, okay? But before we will start, who can tell me what can you see in this picture? Thank you. They are children. Okay. Okay. Who can tell me? Where are they? Where are they? Are they at school or in the museum? Who can tell me? Thank you, Yavasma. They are in a museum because there are some statues here statues okay and in this story we will know who is this person okay let's start our story now are you ready to listen listen well okay Okay, here, Mr. Pen Mr. Benson was the director, the director of a small museum in a town in England. Who was the director of a small museum? Who? Yes, Mr. Benson. Mr. Benson, okay, was the director. Do you know what's the meaning of director? Yes, means al mudir of a small museum. Museum means mutaf, okay, in a town in England. Where was this museum? Where? In a town in England, okay? So, Mr. Benson was the director of a small museum in a town in England, okay? He loved his museum. He refers to Mr. Benson. Mr. Benson, okay? He loved his museum did did mr benson love his museum yes he loved his museum when a groups of of children visited he took them around and showed them all the things in the museum okay what did mr benson show the children yes he showed them all the things in the museum okay who visited mr benson who yes a group of children visited mr benson in his museum so mr benson took them around and showed them all the things in the museum showed them them here refers to children 
show the children all the things in the museum okay he told them he mr refers to mr benson he told them told them them refers to the children okay he told them interesting stories what did mr benson tell the children yes he told them interesting stories and the children enjoyed visiting his museum did the children enjoy visiting his museum yes the children enjoyed استمتعوا visiting his museum زيارة متحفه okay his refers to to Mr. Benson okay now here who was the director of a small museum who ya Ahmad Thank you. Mr. Benson was the director of a small museum. What did Mr. Benson show the children? Thank you. He showed them all the things in the museum. What do the underlined pronouns refer to here? We have he and them. He refers to Mr. Benson and them refers to children. Okay, let's continue the story. So, listen well. There was one object that Mr. Benson loved more than the others. It was a statue of a gold cat from Egypt. It was his best piece, and it was very, very old. It was in a glass case, and, of course, there was an alarm. Okay. There was one object. Shay that Mr. Benson loved more than the others. Who can tell me? What was the object that Mr. Benson loved more than the others? Yes, it was a statue of a gold cat. A statue. What does a statue mean? Timthal of a gold cat. Timthal lihuwa gold cat. Shmeen al dhahabi From where this cat? From where this gold cat? From where? Yes, from Egypt. Okay. It was his best piece. Okay. It was his best piece. Here, al al afdal And it was very, very old. Was this gold cat very old? Yes, it was very, very old. And it was his best piece. Okay? It was in a glass case. Where was this gold cat? Where? Yes, in a glass case. And of course, there was an alarm. Do you know what's the meaning of an alarm? Yes, munabbih in dar. Okay. Here, what was the object that Mr. Benson loved more than the others? Yes? Thank you. It was a statue of a gold cat from Egypt. Okay. Here, who can give me past simple? Past simple? Yes. Was. It's past simple. What else? 
Yes, Mr. Benson loved. Loved here, past simple. What else? Yes, he was. Also, yes, was, was. Okay. Now, who can tell me it here refers to? Yes. Yes, refers to a gold. A statue of a gold cat. It also refers to a statue of a gold cat. Yes. Also here it refers to a statue of a gold cat. Here a statue of a gold cat was in a glass case and of course there was an alarm. Okay. Who can give me an adjective? Yes. Yes. Here gold. It's an adjective who else can give me an adjective yes thank you all it's an adjective who can give me also an adjective yes glass it's an adjective okay Now, let's go back to our story. When Mr. Benson arrived at the museum in the morning, he always went to look at the statue of the gold cat. When he left the museum in the evening, Mr. Benson locked all the windows and doors. He then said goodbye to the cat, and he went home to have dinner with his wife and his 18-year-old daughter, Clea. Okay. Here. When Mr. Benson arrived at the museum in the morning. Okay. When did Mr. Benson arrive at the museum? When? Yes. In the morning. He arrived at the museum. وصل إلى المتحف. He always went to look at the statue of the gold cat. He refers to Mr. Benson. Okay. He always went. To look at the statue of the gold cat. Okay. When he left the museum in the evening, when did Mr. Mr. Pencil leave the museum? When? Yes. In the evening. And left mean Taraka. And it's the past simple of leave. When he left the museum in the, in the evening, what happened? What happened? Yes, Mr. Benson locked all the windows and the doors. Locked Aglaka. All the windows and the doors. He then said goodbye to the cat and he went home to have dinner with his wife and his 18 year old daughter okay did he go home did he go home yes he went home why to have dinner with his wife and his 18 year old daughter clue what was the name of mr benson's daughter 
yes clue and how old was clue how old yes 18 year old 18 year old okay here who can give me past simple past simple yes all right it's a past simple yes went past simple yes left past simple locked it's past simple sit past simple yes here we have went yes all of these are past simple okay here he refers to he refers to who can who can tell me refers to mr benson okay mm. who can give me here an adjective yes thank you gold it's an adjective okay now let's answer this question what did mr benson do when he left the museum in the evening yes yeah Khaled. thank you he locked all the windows and doors then he went home thank you now let's continue our story one night mr benson went to a party with his wife mr benson and his wife were on their way home in their car when the clock struck 12. they were just next to the museum a cat ran across the street and mr benson stopped the car quickly Okay, here, one night, Mr. Benson went to a party with his wife. Where did Mr. Benson and his wife go? Yes, to a party with his wife, okay? Mr. Benson, do you know what's the meaning of his wife? Yes, so gentle. Mr. Benson and his wife were on their way home in their car. When the clock struck 12, and the ma asbahat al-saha, ithna tamaman, they were just next to the museum. Okay? Then, what happened? What happened? What happened when the clock stuck at 12 and they were next to the museum? What happened? Yes, a cat ran across the street. Okay, and Mr. Benson stopped the car quickly. What did Mr. Benson do when a cat ran across the street? He stopped the car quickly. And what did Mr. Benson say? That was a close. Yes, thank you. That was a close. Do you know what's the meaning of close? Yes, قريب. Okay. Here. Who can give me past simple? Yes, went here. It's a past simple. Yes, thank you. Where past simple? Run. It's a past simple. Stopped. Okay, and said past 
simple. Okay. What happened when Mr. Benson and his wife were on their way home? What happened? Yes, yeah, Basma. Thank you. A cat ran across the street and Mr. Benson stopped the car quickly. Okay, let's find out together. One but simple. Went, ran, was, were, here, stopped. Yes, were. Okay. Verb to be. Who can tell me? What are the verbs to be? Yes, we have is, are, was, and where. Here, what we have verb to be? Thank you. We have was and where in this paragraph. Okay. Subject pronoun. Who can give me subject pronoun? Yes, yes, Amira. Thank you. They and he. Here we have they and he. Okay, he. Who can give me adjectives? Yeah. Close. Close is an adjective. Preposition. Who can give me prepositions? Yes. We have on here. Next to and in. Okay. Okay. Today, let's stop here our story. I want you to remember this story very well to continue it next time and have a nice day. See you soon.